Hello Taurus, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Taurus, this is your reading for the mid of July and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Taurus, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Coming back to this reading on YouTube, I'll shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down, and then we'll see what is your energy, what you need to know for the near future, what you need to know for the mid of July, what you need to know regarding your love life. Taurus, if you are interested in getting done a personal reading with me, the details of the same are in description box and comment section. Alright, so let's get started. Alright, Nine of Pentacles. Taurus, time to make some money. Time to mint some money. Time to experience financial stability, financial abundance, depending upon whatever you are manifesting. But I feel like many of you are walking in the direction of financial abundance. Okay, in the near future, if you're manifesting financial stability, yes, financial stability will be achieved. But this energy is not just confined to the near future. It's not just confined to next 10 days, 15 days, one month. No, I feel like this energy is getting spilled over for the next nine months or one year or so okay so even though you probably are manifesting stability in the near future in the long run you will end up manifesting some massive abundance okay so claim this message uh i'm hearing some of you will purchase a home Okay, I'm hearing that some of you will buy a real estate property. Some of you will buy uh, something that you always wanted. You wanted to buy something. You wanted to... I think so you wanted to buy a home or you wanted to make a very big investment uh, somewhere maybe you wanted to start a business and there was a huge capital investment that you wanted to make in that business and you were waiting for that big investment to happen or you were waiting for that uh, home to purchase and finally it's gonna happen that's what I'm getting okay finally that big investment that you are trying to make it it will happen okay for some of you, if you are trying to obtain loans from the bankers and if it was not getting sanctioned, it will get sanctioned. Three of Cups. Three of Cups is telling me that Don't forget to enjoy your life, okay? Work is happening. Your, your focus is absolutely on work right now. Your focus is absolutely on manifesting stability, success, uh, reaching a certain level in your life, okay? So I see that you are dedicating countless number of hours or your energy is absolutely dedicated towards achieving this stability, monetary stability or stability in your uh, stability in your career man trying to manifest success you are absolutely dedicated towards that your energy is hyperly focused towards that even if you are doing other things but constantly at the back of your mind this this thought about continuous thought about achieving stability those thoughts are continuously running at the back of your mind three of cups is telling me that
this three of cups is more of a reminder taurus it's a reminder to you that don't forget to relax and rejuvenate okay intermittent relaxation intermittent uh, uh fun moments will help you recharge uh, will help you give your energy levels back that were exhausted because of work okay so this card is more of a reminder to you okay don't don't forget to recharge yourselves don't forget to rejuvenate yourself okay so then we have the world for some of you uh, travel is very likely for some of you uh moving in a in a place where the environment is different the culture is different is very likely and this is happening because there is a big cycle that you're completing taurus and you're also manifesting this abundance because there is a big cycle that you're completing and you're being blessed on this journey taurus the new journey the new beginnings that you're starting the journey that you're embarking you're being blessed for that journey your ancestors your spiritual team were waiting for you to start this journey since real long time and finally that you're starting like they're they're up in the sky clapping for you and congratulating you like finally the <clears throat> the journey has started and we uh, congratulate you for starting this new journey and welcome to the new cycle so that kind of an energy i am getting you will meet a lot of like minded people you will meet you know what taurus i kind of feel that you are feel, uh, feeling out of place right now okay you you probably are feeling i i belong somewhere else i'm meant to be somewhere else i'm meant to be surrounded by different people with different thought process i'm meant to do something else so two of wands is telling me that you know what you are manifesting a major shift there is a major major shift for many of you taurus i am also feeling that you are breaking the generational curses generational karma okay and this generational curse generational karma will break down with the beginning of this new cycle that's why you are starting this new cycle because in fact you were meant to start this new cycle couple of years ago itself but because of that generational curse the impact of it was so big that the cycle started slightly late and that's why i'm feeling like the ancestors are standing up in the sky and finally congratulating like finally this new cycle much awaited cycle has begun in your life and we are sorry that you had to go through that but you were nominated to break down that generational karma or generational curse but congratulations again for carrying out not giving up on this carrying this out with lot of grit and determination you know what your further legacy is going to be is going to experience so much of abundance the next generation and also you going ahead even you and your next generations they will experience a massive shift in abundance you and your next generation you will live a very different lifestyle now going ahead a lifestyle of abundance but i'm i feel like you're meant to live this experience this lifestyle somewhere else i don't know i you you probably may not be thinking about relocation right now but it might happen all of a sudden it might occur to you that i think so i need to move it might happen all of a sudden to you so relocation is very likely some of you you might have got relocated in the recent past two of wands is also telling me the energy of relocation that you are making a decision about moving from one place to another holding that globe like i'm moving from this part of the globe to another part of the globe let's talk about your love life 10 of cups i'm telling you there is a major shift that is happening for us you better be ready 10 of cups 8 of pentacles and the hanged man you're going to be with someone who is just like you someone hard working dedicated towards career dedicated towards uh, uh having a stable career and uh, manifesting success someone who is very uh 
someone who values their time and energy a lot okay this person is a no-nonsense person and they don't like people wasting their energy okay you will have a family with this person you will have a long-term situation with this person you'll have a big home with this person for the outside world this person might come across as very rude and shrewd they are coming across as a they are exhibiting a boss kind of an energy but when it comes to you you are going to be the boss in this connection taurus okay this person will be absolutely submissive in this connection absolutely hanged man is telling me that this person is already watching you for some of you this person is already watching you okay yes they are coming this person belongs to a different part of the world or they are a foreign national or they probably grew up in a different culture and a different environment even though right now they might be where you are or if you're planning to relocate after relocation you might meet this person even if you meet this person before i strongly feel like they belong to a different part of the world and they are they might be a foreign national they 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 or even though this person might belong to your religion or person who was who grew up in the same culture but they the environment was different in which they grew up culture might be the same religion might be the same but the environment was different king of pentacles is telling me this is a very well established person and they are very hard working this person has some multiple businesses or they are doing multiple things they are very career focused career driven person okay and they really don't like anyone wasting their time they value their time and energy so much and they are going to be very possessive and obsessive about you taurus very very possessive and obsessive about you yes they are coming from a distance for sure so i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe comment down below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person taurus if you are interested in personal reading with me the details of the same are in description box and comment section all right take care have a great time and bye bye